Hey everyone, wanted to give you a day one review for Starfield, or I guess you could say it's a day one slash day two review. Uh, played maybe four or five hours of the game. Haven't gotten too far into it, but what I have played, I've enjoyed. I do kind of want to see what everyone has been talking about on the reviews for both good and bad. For the good, for me personally, I do like how the game looks and I liked how it felt starting off and being able to create my character. Character creation is a little bit better than what what we did have. Favor is a little bit more Fallout 4. I liked character creation on that aspect, but as far as uh, playing anything beyond that, the game seemed to be a little buggy, crashed on me a little bit, audio flickered in and out, and seemed a little unoptimized. That may be my fault to some degree because I am not using it on an uh, SSD. I'm using it on a, you know, like a hard disk, like, you know, you're the older hard drives. And instead of a solid state, I have, uh, yeah, just one of, one of these old boys chilling around. So a good old hard drive. I have it installed on one of these guys and not a solid state. So that, that probably is why everything is not performing as well. I, as of making this video, um, I have, I have ordered a solid state to kind of upgrade my PC. I am, you know, I'm slow, I, I slowly, uh, have been working on it right now. I'm currently sitting with like a, like a 27, um, uh, what is it? RTX graphics card. Um, it, I believe it has like, it's like, I'm at like 16 gigabytes of Ram on that. I've been able to, like a game's not a problem. Like after looking into it, it kind of seemed that the game may have an issue on how the files are actually being loaded while I'm playing. And after doing a little bit of research online, I found that that may have, you know, contributed to the failures that I was coming into with the game. I did have some bugs that weren't related to the game, just not loading properly potentially from the, you know, the files, uh, being however they're handled the hard drive and it not necessarily moving as, you know, everything not transferring as fast, like uh, a few characters. I think the, I forget her name already, but she's the first follower you get when you do constellate, like the join the constellations. She was like stuck in a chair, just like sh jittering around. Um, but if I, I can go back and get a clip of that, I, I'll insert that. But, um, but again, let me just say I had fun. The game was, uh, it captivated me. I am an, I'm a huge sci-fi enjoyer and I would like to see more of what Starfield has to offer. I kind of was put off by the game crashing and, you know, everything not loading or rendering properly uh, for my initial take, but that may be solved with a, you know, upgrade to my computer. I am going to try that and I will give a, another review, an updated review on what I think about the game. Uh, currently I gave it, uh, I gave it a one, I gave it a one on the, uh, Xbox store because, um, you know, game crashes, uh, freezing up on me, audio flickering. Um, even though that may, may be a little bit my fault, but then, uh, on top of that, um, when I, I played for like two or three hours the other night when I came back, well, last night I played two, three hours. And when I came back today to see if uh, updating my drivers and reinstalling the game would help me allow it to run faster. I realized that I had lost maybe an hour's worth of uh, saves due to it being corrupted. So um, not sure what happened there. That kind of bummed me out. Um, I did, you know, I, did, I was able to play successfully um, today on stream for like maybe like three and a half hours. And then the uh, game crashed. Um, but that is also when uh, I decided to look again and see what 
people may have found to resolving the issue since day one, you know, no one really had any time to troubleshoot. Um, a few people were like, try your solid, try a solid state. Um, this is what I got on a, you know, hard, hard drive. And I was like, okay, that's the same issues I'm getting going to go ahead and try it out because I only have 500 gigabytes of space on my uh, hard disk. And if I switch to a solid state, you know, that'll be a terabyte. So $40 for double the space and, you know, overall improvement of my games. It's a win. I gave it on Xbox, maybe a one out of 10. After today, I'm going to give it a, I'll raise it up to for since i got to play three and a half hours today before it crashed i'm gonna give it a 3.5 out of 10 until i get my solid state and then we will reevaluate the game so uh, feel free to tune back in on that and uh yeah i will i'll see you i'll see you guys later thank you all very much